rolling. Pilots, welcome back to Pilot Ryan Media. We are getting ready to shake down our first flight on the brand new A-10 from E-Flight. This is around 1100 millimeters, twin 64 millimeter EDFs, runs on 6S power. Now, being a smaller A-10, I don't think you're gonna fit bigger than a 4000 in here. Uh, I've got the 4000 smart battery in here. We've got it back, uh, I can show you, and I'm CGing at the front of the CG range. So I've got my battery here, and that's an inch or so from the servo, and then my CG is uh, around 55 millimeters. The range is from 55 to 70. 6S power, um, you could trim this up and make it fit a little tighter for you if you wanted to. Rivet detail, panel lines, looks amazing. The ordnance all comes off just like you'd expect it to. And check out the gun. Oh my gosh, plastic molded bits. Pave penny looking good. Look at the suspension. Are you digging this? Let me do the mains. Probably half inch of travel, super nice. A little bit up on the nose, cockpit looks good. Even rivets emulated here in the mullions. The buckets have a nice uh, ring back here. I love it. And then here's what we got underneath. Big, beefy metal trunnions. I mean, this is sick. So let me flip the gear real quick, Bobby. Yep. Nothing to it, guys. And while I have it upside down, I'm gonna point your attention to the elevator surface. So you actually do have a little bit of gluing on this aircraft. Check out the build video. I'll put the info card up here. Uh, it says medium CA in the book. And so you glue on the horizontal, you see no hard points and screws. And the same thing with the vertical. But there are these super well appointed channels right here for all the servo wires and the connections. It's actually super easy to do. And then they provide this servo wire tape to cover it up. So check out the build video for that. I might drop in a shot, but uh, we got the wheels down. And then here's access. Uh, if I open it now, I'll mess up the phone, but your receiver's right here. So I'll break in a shot. Four screws, guys, gets it done. One piece wing. And then the flaps, the book calls out for a small flap to elevator mix. So it's hard to see, but there's just a little bit of down elevator with the deployment of the flaps. But scaled out, guys, and the ordinance comes off and on super easy. Uh, like I said, it's just one of those cleat and slide in kind of deals. Very easy, and they're marked left and right as well. And we're gonna take it up, man. Let's see what we can do on the shakedown, shall we? Let's do it. Let's do it. Rates by the book, 100% full, 70% low. There's expo call outs, very minimal, 15 10s and fives. Uh, I did exactly what the book said. So that's what we're talking about when we're up in the air with this. Let's go, man. Yeah. Yeah. Taking off shakedown maiden flight of the brand new E Flight A10. Oh, yeah. I don't know when it's gonna come off. I'm right there at the forward end of the CG with a 4006S Smart Pack. Holy smokes. So help me goodness. Let's do this. <laughs> Oh my Holy goodness. Smokes. I'm in low rate and it is taking uh, a good amount of stick. So I am going to flip to high rate. And we're gonna shake this down. Wow, that sounds nice. It's, it's so quiet. Actually what I'm gonna do, and a lot of these planes require the same thing. Get yourself some altitude. If you have to trim it, trim it and give it three seconds. So I'm gonna actually slow down Give myself a little bit of four clicks and got it. Oh, yeah. No, I do, sorry. There, I probably got my three seconds. All right, so we're going to settle in here. Oh my goodness. Just want to present this beauty. Oh, oh yeah. I am liking the high rate, feels pretty good. I've got her trimmed out better now. Full ordnance. 
And you know what? While we're moving at about half throttle, I'm gonna go ahead and drop one half flap and see. Oh yeah, it's dialed in. Let's go full flap. Oh my goodness. Rudders, you have two of them. They're very effective on A10s. Oh my gosh, bro. Look at this. Jeez. Lights. Ordnance. Suspension retracts all included, guys. And if you wanted safe in here, you could do it. I'm digging the color scheme. Yeah, this is actually, I think, the same scheme they had on the micro. Yeah. All right, now, no flaps from a standstill. Let's check out the power. Dude, it's still climbing. You see it? Oh, yeah. And I'm uh, no authority. Finally come over. And picking up speed. And we're coming in. Full throttle, Johnny. Yes. Oh, it's so smooth, bro. Looks like it. Woo! Kind of little barrel roll action. Heck yeah. Wow. Some of you guys are going to like more elevator. I promise you. And man, believe it or not, I think I could actually move the battery back some more. So, if you guys do your maiden at 55, that's fine. But you're going to probably want your high rates. It's a little spooky on the down line. Uh, at the forward end of the CG in the pitch. You almost feel like you're not going to pull that nose out, which is not a good, a good feeling. So I think you can go back on the CG, guys. Oh, my goodness. What a bird, dude. So three and a half minutes is how I set my timer, and that's useful throttle time for the maiden. It says I got 24 seconds left. I'm going to go ahead with one more. Slow pass. Rudder around, look at that. Gear coming down. Yes. And we are coming around and we're gonna land this baby and check the cells right now. High rate, full flaps. Keep your power in or your nose will sink too much, especially if you're on the Pour it in. Let's stick it. Oh. oh, dudes. What a joy. What a joy. Look at this. I, I'm, I'm speechless, Bobby. That's a good thing. Dudes, there's the flaps, full flaps. Now look, hey, you can increase your elevator if you'd like. I went with book rate, so what I'm talking about is a point of reference. I would either, I would do two things, one or the other. Increase my throw in the elevator, increase my high rate, leave my batteries right where I have it. Or, continue to work my battery back, even though I would end up having to forego this strap. I think I moved the battery back a little bit. This thing flew really amazing. It is a little bit windy, but not crazy. And that was just AS3X. We have not uh, done safe on here. Bobby is gonna give me his checker um, so I can check it right now. So we did three minutes and 30 seconds of usable throttle time. I have uh, 15 seconds left. We are going to get this battery out. The Smart 4050C performed really well. And there we go. Now. Three point seven sixes, 24% left. Three and a half minutes of what I would say very spirited flying. Yeah. Couple slow passes. That's it.
we're gonna put another one in here and uh, I'm gonna move it back this time. We're gonna go with another 4,000 right now. I got one ready and um, we'll talk about that too. <laughs> Guys, this is sick. Be right back.